I buy my drinks from this store every day. She's really got a sweeter smile, but since COVID, I've not seen it. Let's put a smile on her face. Hi, this is Alex from the Rico Asia Pacific Customer Experience Center. The whole world is still trying to fight the spread of COVID-19 and one of the ways to do this is through wearing face shields. As a precautionary measure, all food service staff here are required to put them on. Today we are going to be creating our own custom face shields. I found photos online of people wearing face shields with some messaging but honestly, these look pretty boring. Since nobody really enjoys wearing these, I wanted to find a way to liven things up and add some fun to it. To do this, we'll be using our Ricoh Pro C7200 series cut sheet printer. This is our 5 color printer, giving us the option to print an additional color on top of the standard 4 colors. There are 5 fifth station color options, and since we'll be printing on transparent media, we'll be using white. The white toner lets us block out certain areas, allowing the printed areas to stand out. This is a great opportunity to add your own personal brand or logo. Also, since we're using digital printing, we have the option of mixing up our designs. Let's go take a look at the production process. We'll use Fusion Pro VDP Creator to create a different face shield for each person. We'll create a template and link it with the database. Fusion Pro VDP Creator can handle both variable text as well as variable graphics. This is done by adding graphic resource files and graphic switch rules. We then compose separate face shields for each person. Today we'll be printing the job directly from Total Flow Production Manager. We submit the job and select the workflow. The next step of the workflow takes us to Total Flow Prep to do the imposition to fit the media size. We then set the fifth station color to white and mirror the image since we're printing on transparency. After the job is approved, it will be sent to the printer for printing directly. First, we need to load up the media into the machine. As you can see, we are using transparent media. The Rico Pro C7200X Graphic Arts Edition allows you to take your creativity to the next level. The ability to print with white means that you are able to print on an extended media range including transparent and dark coloured stocks. Once the prints are complete, we then send it on for finishing. We take the prints and cut them using the Zoom G3 digital cutter. We'll be using the universal cutting tool to do the cut. After which, we attach the strip and padding and our face shield is done. There we did it! Talk about service with a smile. If you find our videos useful, remember to subscribe to our channel. Well, that's all for today. I'll see you next time.